know that. I had no idea. Welcome, 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 welcome. Oh, I'm doing a quick video, guys, okay? I don't know. You got to talk to Lonnie. She knows. All right. Weekend energy. I, I don't know how many it takes to get into a football game, sweetie. All right. So, I will. I hope everybody has a fabulous weekend. All right. I'm going to do this real quick for you because I got lots to do. And my computer is um, giving me trouble right now uploading stuff. So, let me just check something. Is it an evil? Weekend energy. Ooh, 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 we got flippers. Hold up. Let's see if we got any more flippers. I want to love you and treat you right. Oh, you know what? Oh, you know what? I don't need that. Sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. All right. Weekend energy. Whoa. Hang on once. Just gonna lay it out, okay? Knight of Pence. Seven of Pence. Queen of Wands, Nine of Cups. All right. So this King of Wands, okay? They're action oriented, okay? Um, they don't deliver messages. The the Knight of Pence delivers messages. I'm sorry. Who's, what cat is under my desk? Hi, Max. Um, the Knight of Pence will, though, okay? And they're looking at the investment right now, okay? So I don't know if they want to talk about the investment that the Queen of Wands put in. Okay, but we got the Nine of Cups. I didn't even see that. So this talks about happiness, okay? Um, this also speaks of temptation to me, okay? The Queen of Wands is always tempting. But again, we got the queen and the king. Okay, so this is, you know, a soulmate, a tight bond, a connection, you know, life partner. Um, but he's looking away from all this. But I think that was the past. Like, okay, you know, like I was looking. But now he's coming this way. Okay. And he's looking at everything that unfulfills him or her. Okay. But then we got the queen. Okay with the nine of cups so I feel like I don't know if this person's unfulfilled I, all I know is that the middle of the deck the energy is an un, it's an unfulfilling feeling okay um so I don't know if this one feels un, unfulfilled okay and this one's content which would be the queen of wands being content um tell me about the king of wands to me, the King of Wands right now is the King of Pents. I mean, the Knight of Pents, because the King's looking this way, okay, and the Knight is going this way. So the King of Swords, okay, that that would make sense because this is how it's coming in. So this is the Chariot of the Winds. This is the Chariot of the Fire, okay. This is somebody grabbing a hold of their own reins. Tell me about the Knight of Pents. Um, something was very unfulfilling here, okay. Um, the Emperor. All right, so this is this this speaks to the same gentleman, okay? This 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 person to me is an action goer, okay? It's a, the King of Pentacles likes to have conversations and no bullshit conversations, and the Emperor takes control of their own reins, okay? And it looks like they're coming right in at the the Princess of Cups, okay? So this is also a very emotional card. Like this card to me is like flood works, okay? Um, tell me about the Seven of Pentacles. All right, the five of swords. So somebody feels defeated, okay, and unfulfilled. I don't know if it's a tool you or if it's just this one energy because it literally split my deck, okay? So tell me about the queen of wands. Which is the knight of swords, okay? This is something coming in quick, and, and it, the knight of swords is looking right over here. So this person looks like possibly may come in, and she's, she's at her two of wands, all right? So... She feels stuck. She doesn't know what direction. But here's the thing. She also feels dominated right now, which would make sense because the, the emperor likes to dominate. So she's at her crossroads. 
It's she's literally at her crossroads with this person. So this is either I'm fulfilled or I'm not fulfilled. This is either going to be a breakup or a makeup. Okay, tell me about nine of cups. All right, the two of swords. So this is peace being restored with the nine of cups. This is peace being restored. Okay. So for some, I, I'm going to tell you because I said it's a makeup or breakup weekend and I already knew that energy was here. Okay. It's whatever it doesn't serve you. It, it's gone. It's finito. Okay. But I will tell you a lot of people are coming into union too. For some. Okay. Or it's coming. But this is, this is the energy. I don't know if this particular emperor is going to try to come in and dominate this particular woman that is now at our crossroads and is about to be blocked. Okay. Um, or he's about to catch her before she takes her next move because he wants the, I mean, this is restoring something with the nine of cups. So he obviously makes her happy. I mean, he, yeah, he, no, well, he, she makes him happy. Okay. I think she's already happy. She's already has material abundance too. Okay. And, and comfortability, not over the top. Okay. But the queen of wands definitely takes action. It's very presentable. Okay, it takes pride in the way she looks. I'm sure she has lazy days. Okay, but you're, you're not messing with a child. Okay, this person is unfulfilled right now, though. But he's, I don't know, because this song, Make Mama Proud. Um, I don't know if somebody is trying to tell their child in all reality, trying to, um, not convince, what's the word I'm looking for? Um, not coax, but like, hey, like maybe he, maybe this particular person talks about his grandmother, his mother, his aunt, something about something, okay? And maybe they're like, why don't you just go see what happens? Maybe they're, they're trying to be a good influence instead of like a, a not one. I, I kind of feel like that's kind of happening over here, okay? For some. Okay, but this person feels defeated because he's coming in at this one and then the Knight of Swords is coming right at her, with blocking her, but he's also looking right over here. So I kind of feel like he feels defeated, but in a way she must feel defeated too because this is the mutual, it's it's the energy. I, I, I can't say it's necessarily mutual, but she might feel defeated too when it's all said and done because here she goes she's getting blocked again, okay? So for some... You know, what we've been talking about looks like for some, it, it may come into fruition for some, okay? Um, because the night, these nights deliver messages. And again, this one delivers time. This one delivers, this one has conversations, okay? The Knight of Swords, the King of Swords has knows how to have a conversation, but the Knight of Swords sometimes doesn't watch their tongue. So I don't know if it's going to be this woman that's not going to watch her tongue, but to me, because the King of Wands has taken action and the King of Wands knows how to have a conversation. But because the Knight and the King came up in the other read of Swords the other day, to me, this is saying, this is the same person you're going to have a conversation with, okay? And he might pop, up, pop off, his mouth might pop off too. But don't don't underestimate, underestimate the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands can be quite the biatch, okay? So you're going to have to level out the energy here. Nothing looks leveled, okay? All I see is that the tool you can be defeated. To me, to me, this is speaking of one person, whether it's male or female, I have the gender on the card. To me, it's, it, it, you know, this gentleman, again, is going towards the female is what we've been getting. You know, if you're in the same sex, then obviously you decipher who's holding the masculine energy and who's holding the feminine energy. Um... But if I'm going to read it as one person, uh, you know, this is what's going on. This person wants to come in and take action. I don't know why they feel defeated, but they do. All right. And, and to me, this normally talks about investments, but they also know right now that, you know, they're unfulfilled. And this could be saying this woman fulfills them. So they know they need to step in before this person takes one more step onto their path, because there's a chance this person can lose this person. Okay. So with the nine of cups, obviously, you know, she makes him happy, okay, because this is, but here's the deal, this is material happiness too, okay, so this means if she's materially happy, he's going to be material or hap materially happy, okay, um, but this two of swords under the nine of cups, this two of swords literally is restored peace, so 
I'm going to leave this at this because I don't need to dig. I've done plenty of digging in the last few days. I'm going to see if I can pull you any additional messages with these cards, okay? Somebody is somebody's motivation right now. I want to be a motivation. So, I don't know if this one's coming in all doom gloom. I don't know what to tell you. I hope not, okay? I hope not. Additional messages. Okay. All right. So we, we got the, the King of Wands. The same thing with the Hermit. So this person's been soul searching. Okay. I don't. Been soul searching probably since the new moon. Okay. I don't know if this is going to take place around the, the full moon. Um, but this person, the Hermit was reversed. And I don't normally like reading these reversed either. But I will because I didn't do these for you. And I know you like that. So with that being said. This person's coming out of isolation mode. Anything else? This keeps sticking to me, so I'm going to check. It's the Five of Cups. Talks about sorrow. Tell me about the Five of Cups. It stuck to my, my thumb like umpteen times, so I took it, guys. Tell me about the Five of Cups. It's the Eight of Wands, all right? Delivering a message. So regardless of this person feeling unfulfilled or defeated, in this sorrow. So there's a lot of things that play out here. Okay. They're still going to deliver that message with that, with the eight of wands. Okay. They're still ready to take a journey. So that's, that's great. This might get you down in the dumps too, though, because in all reality or the other person, because the emperor, empress the other day, the queen of Pence was the five of, was the five of cups reversed. Okay. Um, but I think that had a lot to do with the energy that was coming towards her. All right. Um, hi, baby. Hi, buddy. All right. So, yeah. So we got the nine of wands reversed. And I think, you know, this I'm not going to hold reversed. This is reversed. I can already see it and I want it. Okay. But this is telling me, look at the person you're dealing with. The person probably does feel defeated. This cat is exhausted. This is not the normal Knight of Wands, ladies and gents, that's in and out, in and out, in fast speed. This cat's exhausted. Okay. Um, and this was, this was reversed, but it's weird the way I just picked that up. That's really bizarre. Anywho. It's the Ace of Wands. Okay, so this person's coming in with a message. And, and, and it, it's got to be meant to be upright. And I'm going to tell you that why. Because we're dealing with the queen of wands. This is temptation too. The, 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 the physical attraction, there's no question. This also talks about, with these two cats together, talks about a one night stand. With the two of them being reversed, it doesn't. it's not saying commitment. It's just saying this person doesn't want it to be like a one night stand. Okay? Tell me about the ace of wands. Ace of wands, please. Ace of wands. Watch your little beak, baby. Watch your little beak. Good boy. All right, the emperor. See? Okay. So, for some, it could be a one-night stand. For others, because I said it was reversed, but the way I picked it up was upright, just wants this new stop. But there's definitely temptation. This emperor is tempted by this woman. There's no question. Okay? I think to me, because the per this person's taking action. It's another night. Okay? It's another night coming in. So, I, I, to me, it's basically, I don't know if this person's going to try to control the situation because it's sitting on the two of wands, okay? And, and this two of wands talks about domination and emperors dominate. So that's actually clarifying who's trying to dominate what, okay? So you're going to have to take that how you want to take that. Anything else? All right, the queen of cups. So, you know, this talks about emotions and feeling them and expressing them. And I don't know who that's going to be or who that's for. You know, it's an additional message. So tell me about, you know, this Queen of Cups. <clears throat> All right. Ace. Holy shit and balls. Holy shit and balls. Okay. Ace of Cups. All right. This is this is true love. This has a lot to do with our read the other day. Okay. So beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. All right. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. Lots of love. Lots of love. Bye, guys.